How are you? Fine. I'd normally be at the gym, but I'm here. Oh, this is better. This is a, this is a, bit, a bit more relaxed. Um, tell us what drove you to go back to the 80s with some old friends as well. Well, I mean, if you think about this, lots of great songs from the 80s. And uh, it was an opportunity to work with a big orchestra. And I've got like a 100-piece orchestra. And you don't get that very often these days in the music business. But you picked some people who you've worked with before as well. How did you whittle down the names on the list? Well, what we sort of did was we did the, we did the tunes first, the tracks, and then we sort of tried to figure out who could sing them. You know, but, but it was obvious. A couple of them were really obvious. You know, everybody wants to rule the world. was so obviously Robbie, you know, a, a male, you know, kind of thing. And, <laughs> but it, it was an interesting experience. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> I mean, th that idea of sort of going back to things or reinventing things, a lot of people say that that is what you did with music in the 80s. That You know, that there was yeah. a moment in time when, um, I think Mike actually was on the sport earlier on, and he was saying, do you know that there used to be a real buzz when it was one of your productions?